Hi guys, welcome back. This is Rakhi Jha. Hope all of you guys are doing well today. That you see in the background is my work surface and a lot of tables and trays you see in the background too. Uh, I do a lot of resin work as well as acrylic work. So I keep things in stock. And uh, let me clear my work surface. Those are my new latest pieces. And um, let's get started with a new thing today. So I'm going to go with the bronze. Actually, this is copper. I'm so sorry. It is so similar, but now I'm just seeing the lighter color. Okay, I'm gonna save some for the top. Then I'm gonna go with the green for all the green that I have. There's enough color to do another pour like this. Then I'm going to go with the Thello Blue. Give it the contrast with the Prussian Blue. Love this color. Prussian Blue is a great color for backgrounds as well. It's not, if you don't want to go with a black background, this is a great um, alternative. Even gray is a beautiful color for a background. I've done many paintings in gray. Okay. Top it off with some copper again. These colors are looking very pretty together. Sorry about the scraping, but get trying to get all the color out. And there's a lot here. It's just um, because it's been sitting for a while, it's gotten a little thicker. And then the gold on the top. Try my new hair dryer on this one. Surround it with the blue base color. And I'm going to really try my new hair dryer in this. I've been experimenting a little bit with the hair dryer, but I still haven't got the hang of it because I haven't done that many paintings with it. Opposite setting of my other hair dryer. That's beautiful. here and I'm going to use my old hair dryer because a better command do that and do that 
that. Oh, wow. This is crazy, guys. This is gorgeous. Just gorgeous. I don't know what to do. I'm so struck by the colors and the cells in this. Just right here. There's a lot of color here. Oh my God, it is insane. This always happens to me when I do leftover paint. And when I add Floetrol to the base of the paint. Okay guys, I don't even know if I need to torch this. Love it. Oh my God, that's the close-up, guys. Wasn't I right? I mean, this is just stunning. Even the veins and the wisps that have come out of this, that's my favorite part. Look at that. This has happened to me a couple of times now. And I'm just trying to figure out that if I'm onto something over here, Just Floetrol in the base color that I'm experimenting with. And these base colors are always drips that make the fantastic painting. And I don't know. I'm really gonna sit and try to figure this out. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my God. Hey guys, thank you for being with me and seeing this one. I'm, I'm really, really loving it. And sometimes I surprise, uh, the paintings surprise me as well. Um, usually I'm always tweaking and, you know, being very critical. But uh, this one, oh my God. It is just too good to be true. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Please like, please subscribe. Let's experiment more together. And uh, see you in the next video, guys. Bye.